So in Ohio, a federal judge has declared the death penalty unconstitutional. You know, because it is. If the Eighth Amendment protects from cruel and unusual punishment, that obviously includes the death penalty. Okay, for those who don't know what happened in more detail, basically it was what we were doing for a long time was we were having Europe make this free drug cocktail. However, Europe said we're done, and now we got a different free drug cocktail that has worse paraly par paralyzing abilities, basically. So that means now not only are people being in mass pain, but they can express it. Because of that, Ohio has decided that this is cruel and unusual punishment. Because it is. Like, am I the only one who thinks it's worse to be tortured in a cell with your own thoughts for the rest of your life, even if you rehabilitate, than it is to just die? You ever heard the phrase, there are things worse than death? I think that jail is worse than death in a lot of cases, especially for lifetime with no chance of parole. So it's hot, and that's ignoring the fact that there's a 4% chance that you could be innocent if you're on death row, considering how at least 4% of the people we put on death row are innocent. Whoops. So your tax dollars could have gone to kill someone who was completely innocent, aka murder. Done. 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 That was rock, and I'm giving this whole YouTube thing up become a rock star now just because of that. So, this is a good thing. This is obviously a good thing. The death penalty should not exist. And that's it. I'm Sifra Joe, and good night.